Ladies and gentlemen, madams and gents, how the heck are you? Um, I owe you guys a, a Wednesday's walk. I missed it yesterday because I was at the hospital all weekend with a uh, mother. Unfortunately, she had a mild heart attack, the doctors say, and it turns out that she had clogged arteries and three of her main ventricles and they had to do a triple bypass surgery or quadruple I'm not exactly sure on the full details of it but it was pretty uh, it was pretty hectic she got let go of ICU and she's doing well so don't worry about all that um, I still got to spend my fa my uh, family time on Easter I still got to have that it was at the hospital, but we still got to have all of that and surround my mom with love and positive energy and prayers and all that good stuff, which is crazy, though, because mom went in on um, the the Semana Santa, which is like the holy weekend for Easter, you know, Good Friday and then Saturday and then Sunday resurrection. She was there surrounded by all the saints and the angels, I guess. Um good thing she's good out of icu and uh but it leads me to the main topic of this wednesday's walk stress yeah stress so if anybody knows stress is the number one killer of men and if you don't believe me go check it out the retired men um they die because they have nothing to do but people who aren't retired especially men take on the stresses of the world and their families and you know we have to take on the stresses of our girlfriends and wives as well whoa hey hey whoa watch out i was just kidding guys i was kidding i was kidding okay that's you know that's a good stress that's the type of stress that you want in your heart it gets uh makes you feel alive and unfortunately sometimes we don't have the best uh, outlets to handle that stress. We smoke, we drink, or we overeat, or whatever it may have you, it ends up being um, very hurtful to you. So uh, I'm here to show you a couple things you can do. I'm here to show you three easy things that you can do to avoid stress or help relieve stress in your life. Because I want you guys to be here for a long time, and I appreciate every single one of you. Take care of yourselves, guys. All right, check this out, guys. Here's breakfast. Now, one of the things about food is you have to eat healthy. You have to eat things that are going to be beneficial so you can get your nutrients and your sugars and uh, the right amount of fibers in your system to get everything done. So um, it all depends on what you're eating. So that that's number one. First key is you are what you eat so start eating better take care of yourself put things in your body that's going to help you get all the nutrients to automatically make you feel better the first thing you do in the morning is put things in the body that is going to make you feel a thousand times better than you know what's what's the alternative get lots of exercise and sunshine exercise is good for your uh, self-esteem it makes you feel great it releases endorphins and it, it releases all kinds of good chemicals in your body that's gonna make you feel amazing after you're done walking and exercising and this vitamin D that we get for free this you know walk around like get let it soak into your skin a little bit not too much though because we don't have an ozone layer anymore and unfortunately we need sunscreen and protect yourself when you're out here guys i mean don't go out there because you're gonna get messed up so sunscreen but then go out there and get that beautiful vitamin d uh, me i i don't have any sunscreen on but i'm gonna walk around a little bit i'm not gonna be out here too long and um actually i do have some screen hold on hold that thought Ta -da. some of that oh i think i got it no you guys need some okay guys protect yourselves also 
And the last little bit of advice that I can give you, the, the third part to, to the trifecta of stress relief is, um, for me, CBD. CBD is a extract from marijuana. It's the chemical that allows health and growth and helps protect you from cancer and it's super beneficial for your body. Acids, amino acids, it has all kinds of beautiful things. Um, also, but mine is a hybrid because, you know, I'm in California. It's legal, guys. We're all adults. You know, we could talk about this. It's a medicine. It's been used since the beginning of time, but uh, marijuana. So I use a hybrid where I get high doses of CBD, which is a non-mental aspect of it. It's all body and healing and like no kind of loopy effects, right? But I also have the hybrid, which also has the, the THC in it, which has a head loopy kind of dreamy effects because I like to believe now something I haven't touched on. I'm a very more spiritual person than you know you actually see. I, wish, I will touch on it at some point. But we all have a third eye in here, the pineal gland. Don't let it calcify people, you know. Use it, it's like a muscle. Something that you have to stretch and you have to feel it. It's like the force. Anyway, I digress. So that is the third part to it. I mean, you don't have to smoke it. I vaporize it because I can't smoke. Um, I'm not, I can't have caffeine, so I have natural sugars. So, um, I'm, I, I'm not allowed to smoke. I shouldn't be smoking, so I vaporize. and um, Or I filter through brown water, which is a lesser effect, but it still works, whatever. Um, that, that is what keeps me... I'm 36 years old. I mean, I don't have a lot of gray. and I think I'm all right. What do you guys think? I mean, not too bad. I'm, I'm holding it together as best I can. Thank you very much. Uh, guys, take care of yourselves. This is, this is all you have, your health. So thanks for listening to my ramblings. Let me get this uh, Wednesday walk well, without further ado. Um, Madrecita mia, thank you very much for being an awesome mother. La quiero mucho. I love you with all my heart because uh, you are who created all of this specimen. So thank you. And uh, I will see you tomorrow because I'm off Friday and Saturday. So I'll be seeing you tomorrow, Mom. Love you. Mwah. Now let me get this Wednesday walk on. Let's get it.